Okay, today we are going to do play the newlywed game. And we've got Michael here, our first contestant. Um, we're going to ask Michael a series of questions, and he'll give the answers. And then we're going to ask Amy the same questions and see how well they know each other. So with that, Michael, we're going to go ahead and start off your first question. If your fiancé could be a famous person, who would she choose to be? <laughs> oh. I'd have to say Whoopi Goldberg. <laughs> Not exactly sure who, <laughs> but Whoopi Goldberg sounds like a good choice to me. Okay. All right. Um, where did you share your first kiss? Um... It was on Las Vegas Boulevard and Flamingo, right in front of the Bellagio Fountains. No way, okay. Can you tell us the date of your first kiss? The day that she flew out here, which was September 14th. Okay, very specific. We like that. Can you just. At approximately oh. 9 14. No. I'm just kidding, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Well, can you describe where you first met, or how you first met? Yeah, um, we met at a chapel in Sheffield. It was actually Sheffield too, their chapel. Um, it was Amy's first day in the mission field, and I was there to greet a bunch of people, new missionaries. And you actually met, you talked, and yep. conversed? Okay. I had their stupid suitcases. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll keep saying that the rest of your life. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then um, how did you propose then? Um, and we were on a trip to California. Amy had two friends, Ashley and Jenny, that went along to California with us for the weekend. And we got in at, to Huntington Beach at like in the morning or three in the morning something stupid like that and we couldn't really sleep and so we went for a walk on the beach and um, <laughs> they kept trying to tell us to get off the beach <laughs> so we just went down a bit further and so <laughs> we were sitting on the beach on a big um, sand dune in front of the ocean and um, they asked her to marry me right there so it was at like three o'clock in the morning <laughs> She was 30. coherent. <laughs> that was my plan, was that she wasn't <laughs> coherent. She didn't know what she was doing, so I thought I'd ask her then. Oh, that's good. That's probably your safest bet. <laughs> okay, then um, do you have a song, the two of you? <laughs> no. No? Um, but if I could choose, it would be Sir Mix-a-Lot, Big Butts. It goes... I like big butts and I cannot lie. You know that one? <laughs> yeah. That's the one. <laughs> okay. That's good. Um, all right, let's, let's see if we can um, get to know you a little bit better. What is your favorite food? <laughs> I don't know how she's going to answer this. I don't even know. Oh. <laughs> um, cheesecake. Cheesecake? Yeah. I guess that has that's its own cheesecake. food group right there. Yeah. <laughs> um, what's your favorite color? Uh, it would have to be blue. Okay. For most things. Unless it's a car, then it's black. Okay. Who is your favorite band? Uh, by far, my all-time favorite is Coldplay. Hmm. Who is your favorite football team? Now, this is English football, like soccer. Yes. That would have to be the um, Sheffield United. Okay, I hear there's Blades some controversy life. there. Some controversy there. Amy thinks I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be a Liverpool fan, but no chance. <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. What is your favorite physical feature about Amy? 
you'd have to go along with my song. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, uh, I think we're the only smile. two laughing. Her smile? Yeah. Okay. How many kids do you want to have? Um, none. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I'd say four. four. I'd, I'd like four. Okay. Um, what is the most embarrassing thing your fiancé has done around you? Um, she hasn't really done anything real embarrassing. Um, I'd have to say something that was really funny was we had gotten a favor done, our car fixed by somebody in the ward, and so we were going to make him cookies and I asked her to go to the store to buy some cookie dough. <laughs> and usually cookie dough is what? Two or three bucks, maybe. She calls me and she's like, oh, I got this really good deal. Um, she's like, I got a, I got a package for four fifty, and so I was thinking, oh, well, if I got a big bucket or something like that. I get home and there's like this little sheet of cookie dough about that big. Probably like five cookies that could have been made from it. <laughs> She's like, and they gave me this one for four fifty two. <laughs> so I think all in all we spent like nine dollars on ten cookies <laughs> that we had to make ourselves. So just getting used to the customs <laughs> and and the difference in prices. Yeah, it is funny though. Uh, <laughs> um Name one thing that you own that your fiancé will throw at the first chance she gets. Mm. I'd say my mustache, but she can't throw that out. That's my pride. Um, I have a tie-dye shirt that she doesn't like, <laughs> but it's still cool. How long have you had it? Sweet. Five, six years. <laughs> Um, what is the first movie you saw together? <laughs> I don't know. You don't remember? Um, There's nothing on your mission or anything? <laughs> oh, uh, probably the restoration. <laughs> <laughs> um, as of like normal movies, I had no idea. Okay. Name one activity Amy does with only you. Because she loves you. Kissing boys, I don't know. Um, watching 24, the movie. Or uh, the, the show, the TV show 24. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, um, nine times out of ten, what do you usually say after asking, guess what? Guess what? I love you. <laughs> what would your firstborn son be named... Um, if you got to pick. <laughs> besides Puffy, um, Ebenezer. Okay, is there a reason behind that? or? Uh, well, Puffy, so it'd be Puffy Combs. And Ebenezer, because it means the recognizing of God's hand in one's life. Okay. Um... What side of the bed will you be sleeping on? Um, the left. Um, is there a reason for that, or just because you st you're me. staking that? Really? <laughs> <laughs> okay. At least we know where you are. <laughs> um. Okay. Oh, I know something really embarrassing. Uh, Go ahead. I think probably one of the most embarrassing moments for me, maybe, um, and her as well was she'd been here for a couple of days and um, she was going to work and I was sleeping in that day. I don't know, I didn't have to go to work very early or something like that. And she came in, it was Friday, and she was giving me a kiss goodbye and um, might have been a bit more than a kiss goodbye. But, uh, <laughs> and my mom walks in and she goes, oh, uh, hey, I got you a smoothie. And I could tell Amy was a bit embarrassed because she'd only been there for a couple of days. <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> all right. With um, with all that said, um, we hope Amy did well. But is there anything that you would like to say to her? 
Um, <laughs> I hope you didn't get too many wrong. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you have fun today with your shower thingy. Um, I don't know what you guys do during them besides watch this. <laughs> but anyway, guess what, Amy? I love you.